Good evening, YouTube. Derek here, Hub All Crazy. Coming back to you with a, another card mail day. Um, this is one of the cards I picked up. If you watched a couple of videos ago, of my uh, random pickups. This is another card I want to talk about in its own video. This is an obscure set from the 80s. I didn't really not heard, know of it until a few weeks ago. So, and then I said, so I want to get at least one copy of this set. So I ended up doing it. But I still don't know a whole lot about this set. So I want to use uh, my YouTube uh, brother in here and sisters and uh, pick your brains and figure out if you know any more about this set. So if you know any more about the set or something that I omitted, please put in the comments. The set is from 1982. It's A2 Tops. But that's either a printing error or the ink ran out during the print run. And somehow they all got in some uh, packs in Michigan, New York, and somewhere else, I think, either in Ohio or up the West. It's 1982 Blacklist. Basically the exact same card of the 82 tops, but doesn't have black in the things. Missing the signature uh, or super, super faded. Uh, the three teams... The Pirates, the Orioles, the Phillies are missing positions on here. And they're also missing little black line border around here through the tops around the picture. 1982 Blacklist. Do you know anything about these set? Um, there are There is enough of this set out there that it's in the Beckett as a, its own set. So it's not like it's just a few cards is kind of a bad print runs and... Uh, sort of like miscuts and stuff and just kind of went up there. There's enough of it where Beckett uh, has his own set. I guess there's less than 100 copies of each of these things or so. Um, there's not all the, not the complete 82 top set is blacklist. There's like 396 of the 726 are in include this set. The Ripken Rookie is not included, but there's many stars like and Hall of Famers that are in the tight 82 tops blacklist. Including like Nolan Ryan's and Ricky Henderson's and Carlton Fisk's and Alan Trammell's and Jack Morris and um, many other uh, stars. I remember trying to see pictures I see, look, cruising the net, doing his research, trying to look at the forums, see pictures. And those guys I can, top of my head, remember seeing cards of that's uh, blacklist. So I picked this up on eBay. Uh, decent price, somewhere very. Uh, uh, very high offerings on them, so then something I just wanted to pick up a star, so I picked up four-time banding champion Bill Madlock, 79 World Series champion. We all know who he is, Mad Dog. I got a good price on this, I think. Um, there are some uh, variations of this of the series that came in, like printing sheets or something that can be a little faded in signature. I'm not totally sure everything, but. Uh, I want to get a true example of the blacklist. So I found this Bill Madlock without the position, without the signature. Um, very unique set from the 80s. Um, proud to have this in my collection. So if you guys have any other information that uh, I'm missing or you, you have any of this cart of the set yourself, uh, please uh, let me know. I'd like to learn more about this set. At least I have some more knowledge. And people ask me about my Bill Madlock card, I can give them more uh, knowledgeable answer because we're always learning right well i'm learning here and i um, hope i'm teaching you something and i want to be taught something here too so this 1982 blacklist blacklist because there's no black ink on her uh, so um, thank you for watching enjoy your evening